All right, we're attempting to pull the lake side of the large aqua dam around the dewatered side, the side here closest to us. Um, had too much water put in into it <clears throat> and didn't have that side of the roll tied back. And so it advanced quicker up onto the bank. It's much more shallow on that side. All right, we got about 60 feet left on this side, maybe 20 feet on this side. We've started wrenching this end around with the pulley system so we can get it to square up with the bank. Okay, we pulled the lake side around. Now the roll is parallel with the shore and right up against the shore. Today is Saturday, and uh, she's got a little head on her, looking pretty good. She's a 32 foot tall, 220 foot long.
maybe a little more. Yeah, but it's touching already, that thing. Yeah. So here we were able to pull the other end to the bay above the shore with the pulley and we have to pry bar it to release it from the bag, actual bag itself. And it went by 15 feet or 10 or 15 feet. Now it's safe and secure in the bay, in the shore. And now we're pumping full time, eight pumps going. Monday, June 9th, 32 foot tall aqua dams, about five, maybe six feet above the lake. We fired up the pumps again. <clears throat> Today we're gonna install the 20 footer and hopefully get the 12 footer into the water here. Right, it's Monday, probably about 11 o'clock. We've stopped pumping the 32 footer. We've got the eight footers in over here on this gap. We're probably about five, six feet above the water level. We've, been, we've started moving the hoses, the fill hoses over to the 20 footer. We've stretched her out, cut the log, and we're about to start filling her. All right, we have all the discharge hoses hooked up to the fill tubes of the 20 foot tall, 190 foot long aqua dam, double closed in, and we're starting up the pumps. Move all eight pumps over here, started drawing out of the deep water area because it's 18 and a half feet right over here. 17 and a half to 17 over here. 17 over here, 17 and a half. 